So for today on your Thursday, our Warmest spot will be right around your lunch hour. So the next couple of hours, our warmth will kind of stop and start to drop throughout the evening. That rain obviously on its way in and we'll continue to see it throughout the rest of the afternoon. Early evening hours becoming more scattered as the night goes on. Now a shower is possible overnight, maybe even some snow mixing in. I think for a majority of us we will stay on the dry side as temperatures drop back into the upper 30s. But really once we get into your Friday, then that rain snow mix will be around and stay with with us for the day. So here's 6 a.m. Again, possible, but I really think we just need that colder air to wrap around and then things get really pick up as we get into uh, the middle of the day on Friday. Again, this rain snow mix, it can be in an off and on again pattern. I think a lot of it ends up on grassy surfaces and it can melt and then come back again. So just something to keep an eye on over the next couple of days. But you can tell even through Saturday and then we'll have it again on Sunday. This does continue. So here's a look at the next couple of days for you. That warmth ends in the next couple of hours here for your Thursday. 45 degrees tomorrow. It's going to happen early. Our temperatures will fall throughout the day and then that rain snow mix will really start to kick on and we're going to keep this through Saturday and then Sunday as well. So Sunday 39 degrees. When we're talking snow, it's always a question of how much we expect. So we've been saying about a general one to three inches of slushy snowfall. Again, it can snow, melt, snow, melt, and this is over the course of several days. And I think a lot of it will end up on your grassy surfaces. I don't think we have many issues with the roadways since our surface temperature and our ground temperature are still above the freezing mark, but something to keep an eye on and be aware of over the course of the weekend. A power outage could be possible too. You get slushy, heavy, wet snow like this. You factor in those higher winds, we could have some power outage problems. So something to keep an eye on through the next several days. Next week though, we're dry by Tuesday, 45 degrees. Rain showers return on Wednesday with 52.